the controversial land deal that's in the works to build a new luxury community on an agricultural reserve over in western Palm Beach County. That's land county residents voted to protect from development more than 20 years ago. I-Team Chief Investigator Mike Magnoli is back with another piece of this puzzle that affects all of us water management. So Mike, what happened at today's commission meeting? Good evening, guys. While there was public comment and two folks spoke out against this deal, they are trying to turn the tide because there are five yes votes on the commission and two no's. Now, last night we introduced you to Jeannie Yerms. She's a local realtor. She doesn't like this deal. In this story, you're going to hear from a resident of Indian Trails Improvement District. She tells the I team that folks out there need this deal to go through and badly. Our daily life would be tremendously impacted. Elizabeth Accomando drove down to the Sunrise headquarters of GL Homes and spoke with me about what the company proposes to do in Palm Beach County. GL Homes wants to build a thousand new houses on the ag. The company knows in order to do that, they need to adhere to the rules of the ag. So they're offering to build a brand new water resource center in the northern part of the county. It would include a large water reservoir. At one point, we had five feet of water in 2018. We interviewed Elizabeth in 2018 when her Loxahatchee property flooded. She owns Barky Pines Animal Rescue. She had to move her critters to dry land, and she was afraid she might have to permanently relocate. Now, she says, there's hope. Because the water can flow into that reservoir as opposed to competing with the canal that's running into the L8 currently. Here's the L8 canal on a map. GL Homes says if the county commission okays their proposal, they'll spend $150 million to build the water resource project on 1,600 acres. The benefits include flood relief and reducing algae blooms from Lake Okeechobee. But Palm Beach County Commissioner Maria Sachs believes that private companies should not be in the water management business. What about this water treatment facility, though? We need that, Commissioner. Government takes care of our water treatment. Why? There is no more important function that, that government can do than to take care of our water supply. Our water supply is the whole source of health for all the people, whether you're living in the city or whether you're living in the county. That only should happen with the hand of government. I pressed the president of GL Homes on that point. There's some concern that a private home builder shouldn't be getting into the business of building a water resource center. How do you respond to that? GL is going to be hiring all the same subcontractors that currently work with South Florida Water Management District and Lake Worth and other agencies that do water projects. Our consultants are former South Florida consultants and employees, and so we will be incorporating the design with the assistance of some of the best consultants and subcontractors that are qualified to do this work. Here's the site where GL wants to build their new 55 and over residential community in western Boca Raton. It's about 40 miles south of their proposed reservoir site. Environmentalists say building a massive development here will damage the natural flood mitigation provided by the nearby wetlands. And they argue that water treatment up north doesn't address the potential water problems caused by thousands of new residents here. But GL Homes says two major advantages of their water resource project are drinking water quality would improve in the city of West Palm Beach and the town of Palm Beach and fighting salt water intrusion to restore the river environment in the northwest fork of the Loxahatchee River. This deal still needs final approval. That vote is slated to happen on October 24th. Right now, GL Homes has the numbers, but will they keep them? That remains to be seen. I'm Jim Grimes. Click like and subscribe buttons if you want to see more stories like this that impact you.